What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna to be unboxing the Rev2 variable rate throttle kit from Motion Pro. It's Motion Pro is one of those manufacturers that make quite ni some nice tools and one of the tools that they make is this uh, quick action throttle. And I've always wanted to sort of unbox one and just to have a look, you know, what comes inside and show you guys what to expect in case you decide to get one. The price range for these things is between $250 to $280 uh, Australian. Um, and the reason for it is basically about for jet bikes, it's about $250, for European bikes, about $280 um, plus shipping. So, um, without further ado, let's just jump straight into it, okay? So, that's the front of the box, uh, as you can see here. Uh, basically, kind of the front already shows you pretty much all the contents of the uh, actual uh, kit. Um, the kit you order is uh, bike specific, so if you order a uh, sports bike kit, you will get the um, RRKM reel or street rod race version. And then if you order a uh, off-road kit, then, then you will get uh, a uh, off-road uh, or motocross uh, version of the throttle. Uh, basically what it is, it's just that ring there, that's the difference, the orange and the grey ring, That's you'll get either one of those. These come actually um, in the kit as always. Um, basically the difference is just the sizes in millimetres. Um, right, let's quickly have a look, that's the side of it, if you can see, and that's the back of it. Back of it kind of shows you and explains to you all the various parts of the throttle. Uh, it shows you also that there's an optional kill switch that you can get, um, so it cleans up. That you can clean up your uh, throttle side of the handlebars, because um, obviously with with this uh, throttle, like there's quite a lot that can go on if you keep your OEM uh, switch kit. Um, so they kindly provide at an extra cost. I think they're about 100 and 20 bucks that part as well uh, and then it shows you the graphs of how the different uh, color wheels will perform uh, the basic rule of thumb is basically with motion pro drive kits is that you get you install the kit that's a bit bigger than the OEM size of your reel um, so let's say if your bike's reel is 40 mil you want to put in a 45 or 50 mil reel that will help speed up how fast you get to wide open throttle. Um, generally by 10%. Let's open it up and show you what's inside. So the way you open it up is basically you've got this little opening here and that's the open box. And inside you obviously get the throttle cables. Throttle cables are spike specific. Um, this typical one I think is for a sports bike as an extent R. Um, so as you can see here, that's the length for that bike. And that's what go, goes into the actual throttle and that goes towards the bot uh, throttle bodies. <coughs> you get two grips. Now from looking at them, they look like they're the same diameter and size. So I'm not sure if it's if you're meant to have them as a spare. If yes, that's a good thought. Maybe you can use it as a on the other side as well. Let's have a look. Okay, so the throttle, that's the grips, and then you've got these variable rate um, reels, cam reels. Then you get this uh, disclaimer. Basically, you know you have to be careful installing this, and gives you the, tells you the measures and things like that. So kind of just a warning thing. Uh, what you have to read before you install it. Then we have the actual outside body or the protection of for the throttle. Um, they look kind of cool. They really do. Like they stand out. You'll notice them on a lot of the um, race bikes in the local series, like racing series. And then you've got the. Um, actual tube that goes inside the throttle that controls the reel. So 
Um, that's made out of plastic, obviously, as you can see. Um, and that's the empty box. All right, so just before we finish this video, I thought I'll basically tell you sort of the differences in reels and how, how it works. I'm not sure I explained it right while I was unboxing it. So let's say if your bike has a 40 mil reel OEM and gets to wide open throttle by 90% of the twist, which is quarter turn. If you install a 45 mil reel from Motion Pro, you're meant to, it's not always 100% the same or works 100% uh, this, like as a fact, but it's meant to decrease the twist by 10%. So like if you if you install a 45 mil reel, you will get to wide open throttle by 80% of the opening, right? And then if you put in a 50 mil reel, you'll get to wide open throttle by 70% of opening. So it decreases the amount of twist you have to give to get to wide open throttle. Um, that's what's claimed, but you know, like every bike is different, so there will be a variance in how soon you get to wide open throttle. Um, it just comes down to what bike you have, um, but it's meant to work um, that way. Now, as I said before, I've sold these throttles quite a lot, and uh, I've spoken to pretty much everybody that uses them, and they all believe that they get a, quite a lot of benefit because when you're down the straight you don't have to take all that time to twist that throttle wide open um, and to get to like the full gas so yeah anyway thanks for watching this video i hope you liked it if you did make sure you let us know that you liked it by hitting the like button and if you keep want to keep up to date with all the videos that are coming then make sure you also hit the subscribe and notifications buttons and i'll see you next time